Hello and welcome. My name is E as in Elementon and today we're gonna crawl back to my youth to when I was about six years old and first tried this game. Ty, this is Mini Tiger 2. As you can see I've been poking around a bit with the game but not any phenomenal progress at all. So just take the we can actually take the, the third one and let's walk right into the action in tie to bush rescue um this was the only tie game i actually owned and um when i was thinking back i thought this was the first tie game oh sure hold on Ty. i know a shortcut uh, are you doing sure hope ranger king got our message uh-huh speak of the tasmanian devil well, this game doesn't have as good quality as I thought it had it in, in graphical in the graphical area. But it's still the time. Hi, mate. You took your time. The little country town of Karawong is under attack. What muck would want to do this? The local security is in the thick of it. <laughs> Look at him. One of their mates is holed up at the old I, barracks. I, I really loved oh. it. Australian accents. It's really Frills on point. The Northern River. Sly, Shazza, I'm going to need your help. You can count on us. If we follow this road, it'll take us up to the old barracks. Okay, let's go. I like they're using slang, uh, Australian slang, which is <laughs> makes the game more Australian because this is set in in Australia. Um, Oh, that's a no-brainer, but it's like still. And the beautiful... Oh, okay. Yeah, it's it's much more sloppy made than I thought, but... Oh boy, I will have some fun recording this though. Because it will wake up so many of my childhood memories. Um, when I play this game. I actually didn't finish this game, I think. Because I was very small, I was very young. Yeah, I was small too. I was very young, and that meant that I sucked at video games. Like, I really. That's the last of the frills, possum. The fire's out. Let's go. Okay, nice. And I was really bad. I probably couldn't even get like behind that jump. Or but yeah, I'm really happy that um, the game developers actually made a PC version of this game. Uh, because I haven't seen it in so long. Let's continue. And I remember, I re Look like out, the only thing I remember is Let me at him. this first, I remember uh, the boss of the game, or the, the um, antagonist, which is uh, the the bird. That bird. Not too far to the old barracks now. But I don't remember anything else um, before I poked around with this game. Possum, we have to get to the other side of the bridge. See that battle bunyip? Maybe you can use it to clear the debris blocking the path. Like the only thing I remember when I was, uh, from when I was uh, little, was that I hated the lava missions and I couldn't get past it. Like literally couldn't get past it. So I hope, I really hope I can, I can do it now, or it would be pretty embarrassing. Let, let's be real. <laughs> But this is like super like funky controls, which I really like. And by s watching this, even though this is like a kids game, I still have done um, a lot of progress <laughs> um, within the we have to keep moving. game. The old barracks are just ahead, mate. The Come graphical on, area and how you move. Because you can really feel that now. this game is 
shut up you two that this game actually I need to change a bit that this game is actually meant for um, a controller but I don't really care that much it at least is not like Ty uh, the Dismanian Tiger 1 because the control was so funky and you couldn't really jump uh, precise precisely which meant that you could jump off of ledges and uh, it was really frustrating when I tried it out because I bought the first tie first because I thought this game was the first tie game so I spent 30 euros on two games me. when I kind of only wanted the first one the but I will I will kind of I will play the second one the, or the first one and some other time but yeah, this is my absolute first video on a let's play. So my question to you is like, how do you think I'm doing for a first let's play? How, how's my voice? I was really like, I'm really anti my voice because I think it's either too uh, dark, which means that it's kind of uh, very boring to listen to or that is too light and it becomes annoying so I kind of need to balance it up and if you enjoyed this video uh, subscribe because I will make a lot of more let's plays I think I will balance two or three let's plays at a time because I think this uh, channel will be like a let's play channel only and I have thought of some ideas maybe play through a whole game and then do a review at the end like play this whole game and then release a separate video with an a comic uh, satire and funny uh, funny review which um, I like watching so I thought I might like doing them as well oh shit and because um, let's play let's play um, videos doesn't take that a lot of time of editing it's just your rambling um, around it takes a lot that uh, you know you, you're walking in a game and do zero progress so why should I even have that in, in an episode that's kind of stuff where you die 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 if you play cuphead or when you no, non funny parts that are irrelevant for the story. Oh shit. That kind of stuff. So, yeah. And my second question to you is what games do you think I should play? Uh, I can play anything from like Cuphead to Wolfenstein. Like, literally everything Dark Souls, Wolfenstein. Uh, let's come here. Oh shit. My radar flies to me, which sucks. Hey, can you, can you please, can you? Oh no, 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 don't do that. Like when I played this uh, the first time, like I automatically jumped out of this uh, thing when I got like hit too many times, because you can see in the upright left corner my bar when I want to get hit. And I think I've gotten it like three times it looks like but I don't know how how mo much more I can do oh shit can you please hey, yeah I just jumped That's taken care of those demon fluffies, possum. and they just Hang on. boom What's disappear that? like magic without uh, except for one where my beautiful friend fluffy is in if I wouldn't Shit have played this game, I oh, shit this. If I wouldn't have played this game a little bit, I wouldn't have known who this figure was. Not if I can help it, I'll take care of it, Shaz. I I really like their Australian accent. It's so, it's so, it's so. It's probably the most fun and important uh, aspect of this game is that they. Uh, have the well, well, Australian well. emphasis on this game because they have the they have the Australian animals like the Tasmanian tiger 
which isn't a tiger it's more like a dog actually with um, with like um, lines on their back that's why they're called tiger um, yeah that's some some biology and some naming quality for you guys <clears throat> and uh, the boomerangs which is iconic uh, Australian and we have the Australian accent and some uh, some slang not only the accent in a satire way but actually some slang where do, uh, does this come from actually I'm, I'm really f darn uh, actually pretty darn clueless where they come from and then we have Fluffy with her better machine than me I, I want that machine can't I have that machine like never mind I take my machine I, my machine is in a lot better <laughs> oh fuck my life or I mean um, happy Sunday and uh, look look it goes from like a triangle um, to a complete square hole Nice. Oh yeah, you and Boo's army. I don't need an army. <laughs> I think you're going to now. I don't need an army. That, that's actually pretty cringe, but it is like Boy, it's a children's game, so it will probably a lot of cringe in this video or in this in this uh, playout because uh, it is a children's game or a children game. Um, so we will have. Oh, can, you, can you stop, please? So it will be like a bit cringy because uh, the dialogue is a lot suited for the children rather than the. Then we have that. Okay. Mm. 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 Come on. And we. Ah, oh, don't do that. And yeah, this game is a lot harder than the ordinary tie because you only have one health now because before your health stacked uh, something like that but now you only have one health and do you need a hand I, I don't really know why why you had it I think you I don't actually don't know why you had like a lot of uh, more health in Taiwan because it doesn't didn't even matter because when you when you finished one health in four hits, you will just Thanks. start over at the out bathroom or out toilet. Um, so I I don't get it because you do exactly the same, but you don't have a have a special count on your lives. Nice. Toodles. Uh, that's not. That's not nice. I will have to punish you in the gutter. Nice. Josh, what happened? Cass got away. You did the best you could, Possum. Yeah, mate. If it wasn't for you, I would have been dead meat. I could have done better. <laughs> he literally Next said. Time, I'll uh, be ready. He literally says that he could have left him, let him die. Uh, let him to die, sorry. English, and not the greatest. Great uh, I cut this ribbon and officially declare open Baramaji Bush Rescue. Eh. I remember that this dialogue is absolutely cringeworthy as well. It's a state of the art facility with an observation tower, research lab, airstrip, and advanced headquarters. That's actually pretty sexy. That, not not her, uh, that flag. Get on ya, mate. Dennis, you won't regret this. With Bush Rescue, we're ready to take on Boss Kess the next time he strikes. Well, it's not going to be that easy, I'm afraid. Why not? I've just got word He's so that clingy. has set up his own country. Just so he can have diplomatic immunity. Why does he do that? You diplomatic mean it's an immunity community. That's stinker. Diplomatic, what? 
as the newly elected president of Catopolis, Boss Cat, and his diplomats are above the law. Sorry, fear that. As they're here on official Catopolis business. They can double park, open other people's mail, and leave the milk out. And Sergeant Blue, he can't touch him. For Sergeant Blue. That's how what, what, what the police squad is called there. It's actually, actually, it's actually kind of cute. Sergeant well, Blue. No time to stand nice. Around gas and we've got work to do. Yeah, can you stop that? Thank you. The local council has been complaining about crocodiles in the okay. sewers, mate. Go see Ranger Ken to sort it out. I will do that, but I will do that in the next episode. But before I leave, <clears throat> I will have to say something about this game. It's been I. No, can I? Yeah, because I've been a very very long time since I played this game. Let me just watch. And this angry Tasmanian tiger has been re uh, re um. What, what can you say? Rebirth. Um, now on PC, it got released in December, and it's still December, but it's like ten days ago, I think. So yeah, if you would like to see more, just um, maybe type something in the comments. Nice video, bad video. You suck. You're pretty okay to be your first video. Um, pretty average. Pretty non-average um, do that type something in the comments if you want to see another game um, other than this type that as well as I said I'm planning on doing two three different games at a time because this channel will almost always be purely let's play and what do you think about my idea of playing the game and then have a review of it, uh, kind of a, of a satire and comical uh, video. So yeah, and I see you in the next video. Take care.